Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Amori. On the last episode, we went in, we uh, saw a little shadow figure across a thing of water, and we went, ooh, a forest and all that jazz. In this one, th you need help with something? What? What, what? what can we help you with? Grumble, 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 grumble. Hey, Burly. Hey, Van, something wrong with Burly? She seems a little upset. Oh, uh, about that. Well, you see... Uh, let me explain. Look at this pole. Can you believe it? What are we looking at? Yeah, I don't see it. Exactly. The tether ball is missing. Van here used his arms and swung too hard, and now the ball's gone far off somewhere. Never to be seen again. I told you not to use your arms, Van. You gotta use your head. Like us. Like this. Sorry, Burly. Using my head all the time gives me a headache. That's because you don't have a hard head like I do. Oh, something just hit me. I'm sure I saw the ball flying off in that direction. Into the vast forest? Eh, we'll never find it now. It might as well be lost forever. Hey, don't sweat it, Burley. We'll look for the ball for you. Heh, <laughs> you sure you want to do that? Vast forest is a pretty dangerous place, you know. One time I even got a super grisly brawl with this ugly plant creature with dead, empty eyes and a gaping mouth. I witted it, of course, being cool and smart and all. There's no monster in all the universe that can outrun me. <laughs> Say, Amori, why don't you and your friends go with Burley and keep her out of trouble? I'd go myself, but... Van! Bros ran over bangs again. Oh, jeez, there's my cue. I'm coming, Happy. Be safe out there, you guys. I'll see you when you get back. Come on, Burley, let's go find your lost ball. We don't have anything to worry about as long as we're together. <laughs> sure, just don't get in my way when I show off my totally amazing headbutt skills. Eh, let's just get this over with. Burley joined your party. For re- aww. I was hoping we had a temporary party member. It would have been very funny if I could just get party members and then never complete their quest, so they're always with me. I mean, it's possible that this is a case where something's gonna happen the moment we split up. A bracelet. Okay. Uh, what does a bracelet do? Defense plus one. Uh, that's just a swell thing to have. Kel was kind of having the crap kicked out of him a lot. Oh, he has Hector though. I didn't realize he had Hector. Hector slows you? No, oh, no, okay. What is Hector? Can talk, but is very shy. He's a very good... I'm never going to take Hector away from Cal. That is... That is an OTP right there. You can have my bracelet. And you know what? I feel like she would like it. We don't need more death. Dang. I was hoping I would just barely not kill him if I just attacked and didn't do any of the follow-ups. That way I could turn him into bread. Hi. Right. Sweet, there's my lost ball. Yoink. Finally, let's take this bad boy to the playground. I meant you to play some tether ball. Hard bulb. You can hear something struggling inside. Well, someday I'll figure that out.
Ow. Cal finally got to level five. But annoying. Straight through the heart. <laughs> because all bunnies deserve death. I see Benoy, I attack. All right, let's head up to the train station. Hey, this is how you get to the playground. You're going the wrong way. Lame. Lame. That one's already down. Bread slice. Uh, Aubrey will guard. Cal will do a basic tag. And Hero will guard. Heck yeah. Red claimed. Alright, I guess I should probably just head back now. But also, I can check this out again while I'm here. I know this is just me a, ca a case of me finding like a plank or like coming up that ladder or something, but like lame. It's right there in front of me. You can't spell memento mori without R. Um, they ate my leaf friend, and that was pretty fucked up. I wasn't even trying that time, I just ran right into it. It ran into me? Something like that. Aw, hero sad. See, it made hero sad. Now it deserves to die. I wouldn't have killed its friends if it hadn't killed my friend, the leaf friend. It ate my leaf. I'll let that one live. Well, that was fun. Not. I'm gonna go play some tetherball. See you later, alligators. I'm out of here. But seriously, come see me before you go. I got something special for ya. Hey dudes, thanks for getting me my lost ball back. As you can see, I'm putting it to good use. Yep, she sure is. I, I was thinking, since you were also kind to help me out, I'm gonna be generous and teach you how to use my special skill. But first, I got a question for y'all. Which one has the hardest head? Well, duh, that's got to be Aubrey. What do you say? Whoa, chill out. No hard feelings. Get it? <laughs> I knew it would be Aubrey. <laughs> that sounds about right. All right, Aubrey, I'm going to teach you a skill just between hard-headed folk like us. It's my specialty, headbutt. It's simple, really. You just run up to someone and... Bam! Wham! 
Now you try. It looks like it would hurt. And also mess up my hair. And also ruin my bow. Oh, come on, Aubrey. Live a little. Having messy hair never hurt anyone. Hero's living proof of that. Yeah, you bet. <laughs> Fine. But if I'm doing this, I'm gonna give it all I've got. Ugh. I feel dizzy. Whoa, nice one, Aubrey. I knew I saw talent in you. Congratulations, you've passed the test with flying colors. Huh? What's happening? From this day forth, I hereby declare you a bona fide headbutter. And take the certificate. Show your friends. I'm sure they'll be proud. You got a butt certificate. <laughs> Uh, Aubrey's so real. For real, for real. boss, it'd be worth trying to make myself sad and then ignoring defense. I'm gonna get rid of observe for now and get stab. And I guess Aubrey should... Oh, right. She didn't have many skills. Deals big damage, but Aubrey also takes damage. Stronger with Aub when Aubrey is angry. Okay. So I can make her angry and then hit with heavy damage all in one turn. Good to know. Listen, sadness is always okay to feel. You can't dwell in it, though. You have to take action. Can't let it stop you. I never said it's not okay to be sad. You just can't only be sad. Oh, I can blame bunnies for it. They didn't do it because they're sad. They did it because they're fucking pissed. Remember what Mari said, Omori. You're stronger than you think. Don't worry, we'll be right behind you. Yeah, and if you fall, we'll be right there to catch you. Cal, don't scare him. You won't fall, Omori. I promise. I can do anything when my friends are there. You are no longer afraid of heights. Man, I know there's a reason why we've never climbed this ladder, but I can't put my finger on it. It's on the tip of my tongue. Oh well. Here goes nothing. So I found the vast forest. Oh, I missed the C key somewhere. You know what? I missed the C key. We're going back. <laughs> I know you're excited about going to space, but I'm going to go grab that. I can't spell my favorite word otherwise. <laughs> Mario Galaxy 3. Yep, you're right. I was making Mario Galaxy 3. Also, while I'm thinking about it. So cute. Okay, so Pinwheel Forest is this way, so it's probably over here. Fucking pissed. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> I will never run from the rub from the bunnies. The, the rummies. What? Okay. Between pinwheels. Where would that even be? Also, did I ever look what was in here? Or did I just pass it up because it was something I didn't want to deal with? Just a tire swing. That's all that was, guys. I'll be real with you, I don't notice the radish most of the time. Oh, hey, a bunny! You told me you wanted me to fight the radish, so I guess I will do that. <laughs> and yet here he is, perishing. Alright, so I'm gonna use bread slice, tack. Attack. The bunny is now bred. And I got tofu. How much bread do I have? I have three bread at this point. That's a lot of... That's good. That's good. Yes, yeah, supposedly. I'll pass that one up just for you, Robin. Supposedly it's up here somewhere. Oh, I'm no longer afraid of heights, so it's probably up this. There it is. Nine keys left as you see the cracks. A, C, A, B, A cab. Okay, so the third word is probably the word black. I really know. A library? Oh, you mean this? I'm assuming it's a cage. Oh no, it's something to climb on. I thought it was something to climb on at first, but then I thought it was a cage, so I don't even know. <laughs> what? I've been attacked. The wind thing is frozen. I didn't even notice that one. Change how I'm sitting again. <clears throat> no matter how I sit, after a bit I start hurting, so I need to adjust myself occasionally. Whether I'm kind of like in a lay down position or standing up. Oh, yeah, I didn't even notice this was completely stopped. It doesn't seem to be working. If only someone were able to throw something at it. That's not a current thing I have. Um, I don't have a skill that lets me do that currently.
there is a hole here. Reach into the hole. You felt a cool breeze. Oh, it's gone. Power Ghost looks around aimlessly as if it is lost. <laughs> Amori looks cute. Yeah, okay, so I can't take it because it's already on a ghost, so. Ah, yeah, some delicious fruits. Hey, Amori. Fancy seeing you all the way up here. The wind here is stronger than it is on the ground. I wonder why that is. Seems like the perfect weather to fly a kite. A boy stirs his kite in deep concentration. Do you want to disturb him? I'm just a boy with, a, with his kite, says Kite Kid. We may not look like much, but we have an unbeatable bond. It's not something just anyone would understand. We'll show you how strong we are when we work together. Oh. That's probably not good. All right. Let's beat up Kite Kid. And let's annoy Aubrey. And just attack with Hero. Ow. Okay. I'm gonna stab Ka oh. Oh no. 50. I'm dead. Ah. Okay, well, I'm gonna take a drink of something before I die. What use is the run button when I can never run from a battle I wanna run from? Never get between a kid and their kite. Let's rebound. And I guess I'll cook for Amori. Ow. Okay, I can beat the kite. If I can beat the kite, I have a chance. Rebound and finally cook. Dang it. Kite kid repairs kid's kite. Oh no. Oh no. I'm done. Oh, that's so messed up.
Uh, stabby, stabby on Kite Kid. You cannot focus this kite. I have to annoy Aubrey. And cook for myself. There we go. Oh no, he's happy. That's not good. Seventy-seven. That's better. Become sad. I really don't think I can do this. <laughs> I don't see a way that I'm getting out of this. Um, yeah, okay. So, what was that? You, you think I can do it, huh? I appreciate it. Amori did not succumb. As the winds predicted, me and my kite are unbeatable. I'm sorry for bothering you and your kite. The first game over. Do you want to retry? Sure. Okay. We're gonna do this differently. Sad poem on kite kid. A kid's kite, rather. Um... We're going to headbutt you, annoy you, and I guess just, oh, right, rubber band kite kit. Never mind, you've been insecure. in general. Okay, um, stabby stabby time. Attack you. Hey, Aubrey, eat some bread. Ow. And now he's happy. This freaking hurts. Uh, let's annoy. 
annoy you. I meant to... Dang it. I meant to release energy. energy sadly. It did not succumb, not that that really helped here. I have a feeling like this might not be possible, guys. I will give it one more shot. Trying to be as thorough as possible and hopefully I don't lose somebody literally turn one. Sad poem on the kid's kite. Now, uh, headbutt on kite kid. Annoy Aubrey. Rubber band on kite kid. You're right, I needed more bread. Oh! Amori did not succumb. I didn't lose somebody, technically, on turn one. Okay. Freaking... Ow. Um... Sad poem on yourself. Headbutt on Kite Kid. Let's give some bread to Amori. And Jack still over their speed. Raise my defense. And make it so I always crit with that move. Okay, stabby stabby time. I'm literally going in to release my energy. Yeah, this is not doable currently. I'm sorry, guys. I tried as hard as I could. Hey, Grim. Welcome back for a second to see me having my butt kicked by a kite kid. I'm gone. Yeah, okay. 
So it's confirmed that I should never have talked to a kid who's flying their kite. It's just not a good idea. This is the game over episode. We're done. I mean, yes, I was kicking a bunch of bunnies in the butt, but apparently that's considered bad or something. Alright, YouTube, next time on Let's Play Amori. We, I will meet you back once I have made back up the progress. I should have saved before I talked to that kid. But whatever. You're right, he's weak to gun attacks. I should have shot him. Thanks, Grim. Alright, see you all next time. Bye.